afraid someone won't be scared of me. Boo hoo. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. Get out! Stop, Gary. <laughs> I'm trying to watch this. Ah, swim team. Intellectual stuff. So, tell me, Petey, do you Come like on. watching the girls in their swimming costumes? Does get, that fuel your filthy little fantasies? Gary, just get out of the way. Oh, Marion, show me your breaststroke again. Or, wait, do you like the boys on the team? Yeah, right, Gary. Which is it, Petey? I see you guys are getting along as usual. I'm just toughening ow, him up. Ow. Turning him into a man or a woman or something. Hey, Jimmy. Hey, Petey. Ah, oh, peace stain. Good to see you. Listen, Jimmy, I need a favor. Bucky went to the auto shop to get some parts for his science projects. He hasn't come back yet. I think he might be in trouble. Please? Why don't you go yourself? I've got homework. <laughs> okay, I'm frightened. And I've got a weak bladder. Oh, I think the bullies might have gotten him. Please, I'll pay. I say do it. It's a good chance to show Russell who's in charge around here. Now run along, P-Stain, before you mark the carpet! Yes. We've got to take care of Russell and his boys. Then, after that, take care of all the other cliques. Soon, this school will be ours. I don't want the school. Yeah, well, I do, pal, and I intend to get it. Now go out that door. And what are you gonna do? I've got planning to do. Knock it off! <laughs> Sorry. Boop. Stop! <laughs> Sorry. complex reasons where a simple beating will do. gonna be good. Bucky, you're pathetic. No, I got you! Come on, panty! Get closer! Are you Mama. hurting yet? <laughs> Having fun? Okay, now we're talking. Nice to know there's a violent, crazy old man on campus. 
thanks, Timmy. That's great. Here, take this. I said I'd do it. Can you help me, please? I'm gonna kick you by the knee. Somebody wants to be handicapped. I'll break every phone in you. When I'm done with you, get the bitch off. It's gonna be wide shut. You're gonna get through a straw. I'm gonna make you a little Give it back! Or what? Or, well, just give it back! Are you threatening me, Metal Mouth? No, I just, just give it back! You can't just steal things from me! <laughs> Unfortunately for you, my pig ugly friend, that is exactly what I can do. In fact, I can do anything I like in this place. Anything at all. Ciao, Spotty. Give it back! And you should stay out of the girl's dorm, you little perv. I see you undressing me with your eyes. Sicko. You wish. Please, will you help me? Do I have to? Yes, it's vital. She's stolen my lab notes. Without them, I'm gonna fail chemistry and I'll never get into med school. Now I won't find the cure for cancer. Basically, the future of the whole world rests on those notes. What's in it for me? Well, if you get them back, I'll... I'll kiss you. Oh, uh, that's okay. Oh, well, okay, but... If you don't, I'll tell the whole school you're some kind of sad sicko who spies on girls getting changed in their dorm. Relax. One set of lab notes coming up. Hey, Gary. I need to get something from Mandy's locker. I'm not surprised. You know, you should put a stink bomb in there. It'd be funny. Get one from Fatty. He knows everything about stinking. I'm a genius. Geniuses don't need medication. I can't believe I switched my meds again. I really don't like where the school is headed.
Where's my underwear all squishy?
Why are they so stupid? So, are you gonna get me something nice? I really, really, really need some help. Give it back! Or what? Or, well, just give it back! Are you threatening?
Hello, boys and girls. I'm Ms. Peters, and I'm going to be your music teacher this year. Give it back! Or what? Or, well, just give it back! Are you threatening <sighs> me, Metal Mouse? No, I just, just give it back! I'm holding your 
driveway before it peaks. Hopkins, we're really getting to know each other. Isn't that nice? Let's see what your rap sheet says. Several prefects have noticed your propensity for violence. I am told that you are always in trouble, Jimmy. Very disappointing. Mr. Hopkins, I am of the opinion that some good works would do you a world of good. Go see the punishment prefect. And I want you to stay out of trouble from now on. Time to pay back the faculty for all their kindness. I don't think you know what kindness means. for all their kindness. I don't think you know what kindness means. You're done.
how it's done. These guys don't believe my little lies. I Are you trying to provoke me? They say it's like hug and sweat and sweat. You're getting hey, awfully up in I'm an excellent boxer, you know. You are. Hopkins, you don't belong here. Get out of here. Excuse me, would you help me, please? Give it back! Or what? Or, well, just give it back! Are you threatening uh, me, Metal Mouth? No, I just, just give it back! You can't... What's up? Boo breaking stunts your growth! Can't keep Jimmy down.
You won't get away with that. What is this, a marathon? She asked me that. I've been wanting to do that for a long time. You ain't nothing. I'll teach you a lesson. <laughs> Give it back! Or what? Or, well, just...
Here you go. Oh, Jimmy, thank you. You're wonderful. I've been waiting for this. That was exactly as I'd expected. There we go. Done. Nerd? Oh. <laughs> How original. <laughs> Call me a nerd. What next? Four eyes? Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt All me. All right, you oh. ass boy. Hey, what's this? Class president. Class president, dummy. It says class president. I know. I That's know. you? I'm the most suitable candidate I know. <laughs> yeah, so's your mom. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Don't forget to wipe! <laughs> How's the campaign, Ernest? You'll vote for me, won't you? Yeah, not a chance. What if I pay you? Pay me? Now you're talking. I always knew I was a born leader. <laughs> yeah, but unless you buy everyone's vote, you're never gonna win. Because they are definitely gonna ruin your speech at the debate. Unless I had a security manager. Oh, oh, please, please, I don't please, know. Security please, managers, they please. cost a lot of money. Oh, I have money. I can pay you. Good. I've always been a politician at heart. Troublemakers will be found.
I'm good. That's all there is to it. Help your fellow Bullworth Academy. I hear you're mechanically apt, but I'm not Sounds sure okay. I believe it. Care to prove me wrong? What's new? Hey, what's going on? Not much. I was just lying here wishing I could be more like you. Yeah, whatever. But I'm cursed. Yeah, really? <laughs> yeah, cursed by brains. 
Do you know what torture it is to be thinking all the time? No, of course you don't. Yeah, you're cursed, you're great, whatever. What else is going on? Not much, let me see. Uh, it's Halloween, all the prefects are at some party and the teachers are entertaining, I use that word loosely, the kids. No, I'd say the opportunities for fun are pretty much nil. What do you have in mind? Come on, you'll see. Let's go get Pete. I got him a real nice costume. I live for this! Inside me. Guys, I look like a jerk. Get no, you look fine. Don't be a baby. His ears out! No, no, I look like a jerk. Come on, you don't be a wimp. Deserve that. Here um, come Russell! I hunger for fish sticks! I put a costume in your closet. Never put it on! Take that show. Never doing aerobics again. Never! No escape from the trench. Didn't have to come to this, but you crossed my line. Ah! A dog pissed on your pants, Dingus. Oh, you suck. <laughs> You're dead. I put a costume in your closet. Come on. Hey, what's going on? Not much. I was just lying. Let's go get Pete. I got him a real nice costume. Guys, I look like a jerk. <laughs> no, you look fine. I can't Don't be a baby. Nice no, no, I look like a jerk. Don't be a. Jimmy Hopkins. Can you help me, sir? I really appreciate yeah, you doing I'm this, in. sir. Watch it! Out. You want to get seriously hurt? Hey, what's up? All right. Why the world can't live up to my step. What happened to your pants? Hey, Jimmy, think you can help me out? Mm -hmm. All right, buddy? I'll do it. I need you to do this thing for me. <laughs> yeah. I swear I saw Edna put a cat into the stew the other day. It's so hard to tell if it really white or just a <laughs> Take your hands off the <laughs> Be? Freaking be. Galloway ought to be fired. Like that hack doesn't know. You're such a loser. Look at you. Jimmy, it's important. Yeah. Oh, many thanks. <laughs> Loser! Open your eyes or I'll poke them out. I keep imagining myself in charge of a large empire. Yeah, please. All right. Thanks. Come, buddy. Friend? Why does the Galloway tell me I'm <laughs> Nice hat, Wimp. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, here's the deal. We're gonna feed Chad's dog some of this rancid meat. Wait for him to take a dump, and what the, then... What the hell? I'm out of here. Whatever, Pete. Okay, let's do this, Jim. I'll explain the rest later. Get over here, you little mutt. Trick for a treat. Yum, 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 yum. That's gross. Score! All right, let's go to the teacher's lounge. You lead on. to be 
He's got to help me with my homework. Bunch of thieving jerks! What's up, Melvin? Ah, greetings. Hmm. Jimmy, listen. Some ruffians took it upon themselves to steal my grottos and gremlins character sheets and won't return them. We're playing tonight. The whole situation is untenable. Grottos and gremlins? Boy, you are sad. Sad? I'm distraught! Role-playing is the high point of human achievement. In fact, Upon reflection, I am prepared to offer a bag of groats to the fair knight, whomsoever recovers these precious screens. Do you accept the quest? How much? Ten groats. What? I mean ten bucks. Wait here. And you can have your pick of my wenches. Great. All right, you've got something of Melvin's. Give it up. All right, I'll give it to you if you beat my friend in a little game. He kicks you in the nuts, you kick him in the nuts until one of you gives up. If you win, you get the sheep. If not, we keep it. That's just stupid. Maybe, but I go first. <laughs> That's some funny stuff right there. Like, I want to stick in friendship. Okay, with you win. I give up. Let's get it on. All right. Funnest piece of paper I've ever had. What? Hey, you forgot you're supposed to be in class or whatever. Some hero you are, come on, right here. Some hero you are, come on. 
There you are. Come on, I found something incredible. Hold on, relax, man. I can't keep getting in trouble. I can't get expelled again. It's always about me with you. Me, me, me. I'm thinking bigger picture, and you're worrying about getting into trouble? You know what? You really are something. What bigger picture? I'm, uh, we are gonna take over this school. We are not taking over anything right now. Time and tide wait for no man, my friend. But it seems they do wait for a wannabe tough guy who's nothing but a little girl. You're full of it. So you keep telling me, look, now come on, I promise you, after this, things are never gonna be the same again. Oh, I'm so excited. I should have stopped taking those pills ages ago. Yeah, right. Whatever you say, Gary. Mommy called me yet. I wonder if she's mad at me. Hey, 
experience. Jimmy's gonna kick your ass. Right, Jimmy? Come here, scum. Don't stop. This is great. Have a switch. You're really gonna like this, Jimmy. We can't get in there. How can we get at the switch? Use your slingshot to hit the broom. Jimmy, you dunce! Use your slingshot to hit the broom. Not here, follow me. Now here's another switch I used to... Whoa, live wires! This one, so you Let's can go see over this one over there. Hmm. Looks like I'll have to hold this down to get the power while you climb through and get the switch. I've never seen one. If you could lower the furnace temperature a bit, I bet the steam would stop. Oh, there's a fire extinguisher in plain view. Maybe that could better collect be that. Words. Quick, before it heats up again! place where this school separates the men from the boys, the wheat from the chaff, and all that nonsense. Okay, so what's that got to do with standing up to people, keeping them in line? 
This is where I stand up to you, my friend. What are you talking about? I know you hate me, Jimmy boy. I know you said all that stuff about me behind my back. What are you talking about? Don't play innocent with me. You want to run this school? I want to run this school. Only one of us is going to make it. And it's going to be me! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and morons, I give you Russell! Oh, man. Me, Russell! Gary, now I hate you. I know. Russell. Go beat that little jerk who said that nasty stuff to me about your mom and those barnyard uh, animals. What? Come here. Russell wants vengeance. Jimmy boy, here we are. You think you're tough, huh? Jimmy boy, here we are.
you happy now, jerk? Ecstatic. I love to watch two morons beat the crap out of each other. Why'd you do it, Gary? I thought we were friends. <laughs> friends? You and me. I've taken dumps that had more brains than you, friend. No. I'm taking over this school. And you're just a liability. See you around, moron. Well done, Jimmy. Yeah, great. What a waste of time. You all right, Russell? Oh. Mm. Oh. Yeah? Look, I never said anything about your mom or farmyard animals. You did it? No, but I want you to stop bullying weak kids. Why? Ah, because there are a bunch of kids around this place who need a beating, and you're picking on the few who don't. So I want you to leave me and him alone. Oh, okay. Sorry. Bad Russell. With Russell pacified, I could be forgiven for thinking my troubles at Bullworth were over. But this place is a rotten onion. Peel off one stinking layer, and there's another even smellier one beneath. <laughs>